Yo guys, how's it going? AK Moto here. We are back here in the shop living another day. And today, as you guys have probably saw the thumbnail or seen the thumbnail on the side already, we got a fresh graphics kit here for the 250. And here it is right back here. And uh, we're gonna be installing those today, getting those all nice and put on. And we also have a fresh kit for the 125 that's sitting right down there. I uh, might install that today, I'll just have to see uh, how quickly we can get the 250 done. And I also have some other stuff to do. I have to finish up truing that crank. Uh, it's right back here, somewhere over here. I have to finish up truing a YZ125 crank, not for my 125, but just a uh, old scrap crank that I am rebuilding. Uh, over here we have a 250 that I'm working on, the carb's fighting me. So I might have to do that later, but here I'm gonna try to get the 250's graphics all knocked out and good to go. So uh, yeah, let's take a look at our fresh kit right back here. And we also have some fresh plastics as you guys saw in one of the last videos. I'll put a little teaser, a little um, banner thing here in the top right so you can check out that video. But I just recently went through the 250, greased up all the bearings and made sure mechanically it was good to go because obviously we wanna get the bike mechanically dialed before we worry about stickers. I mean, I love stickers, but I also care about how the bikes run and work and all that good stuff. So we also got some more fresh plastics down there to help the color scheme we're going at. And uh, here I'm gonna show you guys a graphics gear real quick. So here's a really, really quick look at the kit. Sorry, I can't really lay it out piece by piece, but it's the AK Moto. In this kit, we're going with a lot of blue and black. So it's gonna be blue, black, and white, and a little bit of red uh, decal. Uh, just some accent pieces that look really sweet. But uh, yeah, here's what we have to work with. Again, sorry, I can't give you guys a super great shot here, but you guys will see as it goes on the bike. Now for installation here, I'm just gonna be using some Windex. Uh, I try to install them dry, but wherever I can't, I like to use some Windex to line it up. Uh, we have some rubbing alcohol, some isopropyl alcohol right here, some contact cleaner. Now this stuff will actually kinda uh, rub away the kind of gloss on the plastic, so I gotta be careful when using this. We shouldn't really have to use a lot of this though because our plastics are all bare. And here we have just some shop towels. And over there we have some scissors for trimming some backing paper. And all the plastics on the bike are pretty much naked so we don't have to worry about ripping anything else off. These here I'm gonna be replacing. Uh, now here I am gonna be laying some graphic over our stock uh, decal, or this isn't even a decal, but this is just our stock uh, radiator shroud. We're gonna be laying some plastic just over this YZ. I'm sure some people might get a little heated by that, but it's not a decal or anything, so this isn't gonna get damaged if we throw a big sticker over it. And uh, one of the main reasons I wanna get a graphics kit is not only to make my bike look pretty nice, not only to personalize it, but also to help protect the plastics too. The graphics kits can do a really good job of protecting plastics. Uh, here you can see some scuff marks. If I get this to focus, and the graphic helps to protect our plastics from scuff marks. I know it's a dirt bike, but you guys know how I am. I always like to get them stickers on there to help protect our plastics. And right under here, I have some new rear number plates and a new rear fender. And uh, as you guys can probably tell already, I'm gonna be blacking out the back of the bike and leaving the front half blue, kind of like how the 125 is, except it's not gonna be as liney and it's gonna be a little more blue and black versus black and white and blue. Uh, you guys will see what I mean here in a few minutes, but uh, yeah, I think this is gonna be pretty sick. So let's jump right into it. Uh, here I'm not gonna record everything because I'm sure you guys know how graphics go on. You literally just lay them on the plastic. So I'm just gonna be updating you guys as I progress through this. And uh, yeah, it's all showed up. Let's get to work and let's get these fresh stickers on the bike. Heck yeah. Now I personally find it the easiest to do graphics with the body panels off of the bike. So as I move around the bike, I'm just gonna take off each body panel and do them all one at a time and slowly get this done. So let's get started. guys we got the first panel on not perfect but we are getting there so I'm gonna throw this on the bike and uh, move on to the next panel let's get it
All right, guys, so it is getting a little later. It is actually about to be 10 o'clock, um, but the bike is all done, all stickered up. It is right back there. I'll show you guys tomorrow, though, get a little montage going so you guys can get a nice, proper look at the bike. Um, now, this was a, definitely a pretty good reminder that I am not the greatest with graphics. Uh, here on the 125, uh, it's a little easier to graphic up because the plastics are a little more pointy and not as rounded and curved like the 250. But because the 250's plastics are so curved out and rounded in so many spots, there are a lot of spots where you kind of just get a little, a little wrinkle and it's hard to work those out. But I did my best and I think it turned out pretty sick. So again, I'll show you guys tomorrow, which will be about five seconds for you guys. Um, but yeah, I'm super pumped with how the kit turned out. And uh, yeah, so I have a little bit of cleanup to do. And I'm actually gonna throw the 125's kit on. Uh, maybe tomorrow, I don't know, it'll probably be in a different video. But uh, yeah, so I don't really have anything else to say. I gotta get a little bit of stuff cleaned up and I'll see you guys tomorrow when you guys get to get a nice look at our new kit.